Hey guys, welcome back. This is Dominic with Silver Screen Reviews, and this is Uncharted 4. <coughs> oh, Thief Send. <laughs> Last time we left off, we watched our brother die. Or we assume. I, we know he lives. Like, we know that. It, it's not a big secret when there was a whole fucking trailer about it with him talking to his brother. After he thought he died in a Panamanian jail. I'm really upset about that. Like, I'm. If that's supposed to be a big plot twist, you know, even early on, it's supposed to be. Don't, don't put out the trailer for that. Not at all. Don't do that. Don't do that. Um, but now we're living domestically in this nice two bedroom with an attic house. I'm sorry, I meant to say two floor, but it could be two bedroom. I think Elena down here made dinner. You were up there a long time. Hey. Well, I was researching something. Oh, is that what we're calling it? These what days? the hell is that? Hey, would you mind grabbing the food? I'm just. Is that an original yeah, PlayStation? Yeah, sure thing. Thanks. No. Let me play this. What? Lena, you lazy piece of shit. <laughs> I'm assuming it's spicy dumpling. No. No. Oh, what the fuck? And no, get the beer. Get the Oh my god, we haven't drank yet. Um There we go. Good man. We'll drink here in a second. I wanna get to a Nice twist up. Are we gonna drink any of it or? She made it in. No, don't put the beer down. Assuming we're eating on the couch. Done. Okay. Oh. Finish it? Yeah. Oh. No. Probably too long and full of typos, but that's what editors. Fuck for. yes, that's what I'm drinking to. Hell yeah, that's exactly what we're here for. Looks good. Mm -hmm. Three, two, one. Cheers, guys. How was it what? Huh? Got none of that. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry. How was your day? Oh, it was fine. Mm -hmm. Typical day in paradise. Mm -hmm. I, uh, I got to pull a bunch of garbage out of a river. Mm. Yeah. At least you got to go for a swim. <laughs> Find any exciting garbage? Oh, it's a brilliant stuff. It was a uh, early 21st century truck. We got early <laughs> the natives called it a semi. Oh dear lord. Okay, so, so it, it, boring stuff. But tell me about the article. Well, it started out as this fluff piece about tourism in Bangkok, but I don't think the magazine is gonna like the angle that I'm taking because everyone immediately commented about how rude the smog was, that it was like shock to the lungs every second that you got off the plane. So, so clearly we're unhappy. <laughs> Not with Elena, just with life. Ah. What? Where are you? I'm in... Here, being stabbed with a fork. Oh, really? What? Just keep going. It was, it was interesting. Don't even lie about it, dude. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. What's my article about? Bangkok smog. What? This one? Mm -hmm. Oh shit. Um. Uh, the people of of uh, Bangkok. And, and the smog. Da ha! Fuck you, Oila. Can't get a flight anywhere, and people can't breathe. Wow. <laughs> right, I'm sorry. No, it was Valiant. It I was, was in the really ballpark, right? You were. I was super in the ballpark. State, but yeah, you were in a ballpark. <laughs> Jameson asked you about that Malaysia job again. Jameson always asked me about the Malaysia job. Look, Nate, I really think that you should take it. What? Fuck it, let's go then. You know what? I don't want it. Really? I mean, he doesn't have the permits. And we agreed we're not going to take that kind of work anymore. It's okay, just not worth it. it. It doesn't sound that risky. All right? If it's just a permit. No way. You could call Sullivan. <laughs> you haven't seen him Elena. in about two years. Well, could we please drop this? Okay, I just don't want you to not take it because of me. I'm That's not funny. taking it because of me. Okay. I kind of thought it was because of her that we weren't going to take it. I appreciate the gesture. It's just... 
I'm gonna go ahead and do the dishes. No, stop, I'll do them. No, you on. did them last night. No, you cooked. I cleaned. It's fine. I mean, at least, at least, uh, let me let me try to earn it or, or something. Let me um, play you for it. You'll play me for yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your little TV game thing. TV I game I beat thing. Your high school. Beat your high school. What the fuck does that even mean? TV game thing. We're playing Pac-Man. You don't even know what it's called. I don't need to know what it's called. <laughs> I've seen you play. It's right. jumping and running, and I have a natural talent oh, for that. Really? So what do you say, chicken? Is it a bet? Fuck, that's a bet. Let's roll. Oh wow. Okay, cowboy. Ah, his cheeks even popped out. I like that. It's an original Sony PlayStation. Okay. Holy shit, it's a PS1. Oh, I'm learning all right. It even has a sound. Oh my god. Is this it? No, it has to load. <laughs> yes. You <laughs> have no patience. When you turn something on, you expect it to. Okay. <gasps> it's it's Crash fucking Bandicoot. I, Naughty Dog made this right. Holy shit. Is there a problem? I fucking love it. This is perfect. This is brilliant. I don't know why she only has a PlayStation One. I don't know what year is right now, but this is fucking brilliant. I want to play. Can I play Crash Bandicoot now? Why haven't they ported that for PS4? Run forward, asshole. Run toward the apples. Run to the oh! As I'm yelling, guys. I'm in control of Crash Fucking Bandicoot! No, I'm getting everything, because I'm pretty sure there's probably like a trophy or some bullshit. Right, um, Got it. You'll want to jump over all the pits and the obstacles. Come on, it's like my thing. Okay, run away from the boulder. Why is the boulder chasing me? Just run away from it. I did nothing to this boulder. Use your <laughs> the boulder's always an asshole, dude. Don't even- Oh, no! Watch that pit. Left the apple behind. Oh, what happened? You fell in the pit. Do I get to start over? How do I uh, climb back up? You're dead. Well, that's not realistic. I I would have climbed back up. <laughs> I would I would have climbed back up. Climbing's always helped me. God damn it! I can't believe I died in this game. I died in a game in a game. It was fucking phenomenal. I'm like the happiest I've been in a long time. Holy oh, hell! Oh yeah, we go there. Not bad. Not bad. Okay, that's right. Breaking the boxes. At least they kept that. Good jump, jump. Stop yelling at me. I'm right? Coaching, I'm coaching you. Keep going, keep going. Is it a fox? A bandicoot. Looks like <gasps> a fox. It's like a fox in jeans. Shit. Okay, smash the box. No! Oh, that had to hurt. It did probably hurt. <laughs> I can't. I can't play this game right now. Oh, hold on, hold on. I need more beer. I need more beer. I can't do this. This is. This is the- I have a minute and a half. Holy shit. Uh, three, two, one, cheers. This- I own this Bash Bandicoot- or, uh, Crash- this Bash Bandicoot game. hundred gives you an extra life. hundred? Who's got time to pick a hundred pieces of fruit? <laughs> you don't pick them, asshole. Oh my god, this is- I- this is- uh, for somebody who's a fan of this game, this is phenomenal, and I need to be better at it. Look anything like a bandicoot. Have you ever seen a bandicoot? A bandicoot's not a real thing, by the way, Alina. Sure uh, these graphics are pretty good. No, they're not. Aren't they? Checkpoint. Run towards the bottom. I know, I know, I just like to explore, you know? Right? Exploring's fantastic. It's what we do in this game, Alina. Nice. Uh, right? Why is he stealing all this fruit? Fox is oh, shit! Fruit. He's not stealing, he's collecting. Well, it's not his, and that's called stealing. <laughs> huh, yeah. You're the wrong person to be talking about this bullshit. Nothing. Smacking it. Stay focused. Where's the crystal hole we should get up there? It's not game end. What? Oh. <laughs> what? Is that it? You asked for it. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Alina looks different to me. You can give it another shot. 
Come on, double or nothing. My car could really use a good cleaning. Really? Really? You're going to start yeah. the smack talk There's now? There's this mode called easy mode. I just switch it. It's way no, easier on no, me. Just keep talking. Oh, no. Fuck you, Elena. What are you going to do? I'm, I'm warning what you. What are you going to do? I'm warning In real life, what hey, can you do? I'm Show me. You. What can you I'm do in you. real life? What do you think about that? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, I want to play video games. Fuck the sex. Hey, are you happy? Yeah, of course. He's, he's happy in one way, but... Um? Um? <laughs> really? Come here. And here's the cutscene. I, I posted it on a, on my blog a while back. It's uh, one of those big cutscenes where they release from a game that like tells you a lot about what's happening. Not open yet. Oh shit! I should be quiet. Sorry, guys. Just ignore my drinking. We're closed. Come on, man. All right, I'm coming. I'm coming. Yeah, can I Ta-da! Yeah, I'm, uh, looking for my little brother. It's about your height, a little bit leaner, definitely less gray in the temples. Sam? It's good to see you again, Nathan. Oh, God, Sam. Oh, all right, all right, all right, take it easy, take <laughs> it easy. <laughs> How? How? I thought you... I saw you get shot. Yes, you did. Right there. Huh? Jesus. <laughs> well, the doctors, they... I mean, doctors, they patched me up and they... tossed me right back into the cell. Yeah, but I... I made calls. I, I checked everywhere. I, everything I heard, everything I found, it, it all confirmed you were dead. Well, Nathan, we killed a guard, okay? So they wanted to see me rot in that cell for the rest of my life, and I nearly did. Jesus, Sam, I... Man, if I had known, I, I, I swear to you, I would have you come back. You would have come back. I know, Nathan. I know. What's important now, though, is that I'm out. <laughs> hey, hey. You still with me? I need some air. <laughs> You're not gonna pass out on me or nothing, I... are you? Just might. It's a lot to digest, you know. But how, how did you get out? When did you get out? How, how'd you even get here? Find me. All right, right, right. Slow down. Have a seat. I want to hear about you? Huh? Me? Yeah. What's to tell? Well, call some of your old contacts. Tell me some pretty crazy ass stories. Jeez, what crazy stories? Got shot, hanging from a derailed train in the Himalayas. I mean, that's a thing. It happened. That actually happened. Come on, man. What did I miss? <laughs> Where do I start? Start with the best part. Oh, the best part, huh? Ah, uh, the best part. <laughs> okay. Um, a few years back, I got roped into uh, breaking into this Turkish museum to steal this oil lamp. Okay. Oil lamp. Uh, it was an artifact from Marco Polo's lost treasure fleet. Kubla Khan's treasure. Yeah, yeah. And as it turns out, it was a whole hell of a lot more on those ships than just treasure. I mean, what can I say? Another lost city destroyed. Thanks to Nathan Drake. We made it out alive. Makes what three for three now? You could have been there. No, it, it's literally unbelievable. You, you tell me you stumble upon yet another archaeological <laughs> gold mine, and somehow you manage to walk away with nothing. That was nothing. Yeah, well, it's a story of my life, I guess. But, you know, I managed to grab a few trinkets here and there. Mm. Paid off the car, the house, the engagement ring. The engagement ring? I'm married. I can't believe uh, Elena from the stories. That's my wife. You gotta come meet her tonight. Dinner at my place. You're coming to dinner. I can tell her all about you. 
Kid, I gotta tell her all about you. Hey, right? Like, that's a whole, whole separate I'm in a arc. Lot of trouble here. And of course you are, Sam. Because you don't come looking for your brother like this if you're not. Is the name Hector Alcazar ring a bell with you? No. Yeah, he's the, the drug lord. Mm -hmm. Butcher of Panama, right? Why? It's a funny story, but... Uh, you say funny. Last year, he was my cellmate. So this is how I got out of prison. You're not reading tonight. Sam, you come here. Hey, Sam. The guards, they're singing. Eh, well, they're probably drunk. Perhaps. But they are content. How can they be content with their small lives and miserable jobs? Some people like their small lives and their miserable jobs. What do we got? Huh? No offense. We have ambition. Oh. <laughs> and when we get out of here, that ambition will take us to places these idiots cannot even imagine. I don't disagree, but uh. Your optimism. What will you do when you get out, Samuel? <laughs> That's if I get out of here. Sure, you can imagine. I can. But I want to hear you say it. I will find the greatest pirate treasure of all time. Which I'm sure you are sick of hearing about by now. Oh, no. The tale of Henry Avery and his 400 million in jewels and gold has... become a sweet lullaby for me. Perfect. So we lure this crazy madman into our scheme. Thank you, Sam. Given the opportunity? Absolutely. <laughs> Ambition. What is that Avery quote? <laughs> I am a man of fortune, and I must seek my fortune. I like how he thinks. It's... it's... What the hell was that? It's circumvents. It's not even a real quote. Like, it's not a real quote, but it doesn't even... Señor Alcázar, un gusto verlo. It doesn't make any sense because you can't be a man of fortune seeking your fortune. Samuel, are you ready to seek your fortune? Yeah. Come on. Controls are mine. Chapter 5, guys. Hector Alcazar. The drug lord, the butcher of Panama. You know always bold? Since the moment I set foot in this place. Samuel, keep up. I feel like I'm going bold. You have to move quickly. Holy shit. Oh, we murdered. Oh, hello. Don't get drunk and play cards. What did you guys get for living in fucking Panama? Let me do it. Let me do it. Oh. Oh. These men are sadistic. We're doing the world a favor, huh? Here. You'll need this. Yeah, well, give me. You remember how to use it. It's like riding a bike, yeah? Come back to me. I've got all those last words. Back to me now. Well, Hector. The moments of gold. We'll start a goddamn the reflections of light. Okay, exactly. no, I'm sorry, guys. Hagalo. The cross on did the, what? Why did we trigger that? I, I'm sorry, I was seeing something the off. I just. I don't have to shoot anybody. I like that it gives me the. Oh, yeah, I'm not gonna even bother. I'm pretty sure I'm not really. Oh shit. Oh, I really don't know. God damn it. 
Let's do this. Yeah, I see. Give me. Absolutely take that. Is everything out here? So now what? Estamos en posición. Están listos? Thank you. Enemy and drug lord for freeing me. Perhaps this. Why? Just do it. Yeah, what? Okay. You are right. Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah, I mean like a simple warning like the wall's about to explode out from under you. I'm not dealing with them, I don't have to. I'm just not gonna even bother. Oh, what? You know what? It's just, it's just habit at this point. I, I couldn't correct it if I tried. Especially that I think, oh, hello. Walk me. What? Why are you surprised at this fucking wooden? Yeah, exactly. Just, just go. Like, nah, I'm, I'm happy with what I have. I've become accustomed to it. The what? Shards are enough to kill somebody. The window shards, I guess, but. Supposed to be down here? Make my way up here. I'm 
remember all these years ago the last time we tried to escape from here? This is how many fucking shot. And being fair was a Canadian uh, drug lord. <laughs> Prison insurance. Simple enough. Still really upset about that Crash Bandicoot score. Now, water's for bitches. Yeah, so drink. No, no, I'm good. I'm better than good, actually. You're dehydrated. Go ahead, drink. Thank you. Three twenches! So, what's next for Samuel Drake? Huh? Mm. <sighs> Jesus, what is next? Finding Nathan Drake? Uh, I'll take a bath. I'm gonna sleep in a real bed. Maybe find a nice warm body to sleep next to me. Uh, track my brother down. Seems like a pretty good start. Uh, it is. But. So, uh, how long do you think it will take for you to retrieve Avery's treasure? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I, uh, I get back to the States, I can resume my search. How long? It's kind of hard to say until I get started. You said you know what I did. Yeah, uh, I do, okay, but... Listen, it's, it, it's not like Avery left some map with a big red X on it, okay? But I've, I've, I've got some very solid... Oh, okay. Yep. Just, just, just wait a minute. Take, take, take... Hey, take it easy! Uh, I like you, Samuel. More importantly, I believed you. That is why you were here. I can, I can get it, okay? I, I just need some time. Tell me, Uncle Gio. You see, the problem is, I'm having all these doubts into my mind. We're looking for a goddamn treasure, Hector. Calm down. I'll find it. I swear. To you. <laughs> How long? Six months. That's funny, that's the exact number I was thinking of. People are lazy. They always ask for more time than they actually need. Three months. Three months is a bad. Three months. Half the treasure. Can you do it? Say it. Three months. Half the treasure. Now, if you run or try to hide the treasure, or do something really stupid like go to the authorities. Oh no. And when you least expect it, I will be there. At that point, death is not a mercy I will grant you. Here. Come on. Now, the nearest town. It's Ten kilometers in that direction towards the sunrise. Been a while since we've seen the sunrise outside, huh? Vamos. <laughs> Great lot of money. Handsome water. I find it. Then what? Don't worry. When the time comes, I'll be there to collect. What does that mean? It's worth it, Samuel. You put a side up your ass, dude. Uh, lets me go, and here we are. This is bad. No shit, mate. Up the trail where we left off. And... Wait, trail? Sam, there's no trail. After Rafe and I escaped, he took his parents' fortune and bought up all the land around St. Dismas Cathedral. We combed that place for weeks. Avery's treasure isn't there. Not that that stopped Rafe. The moron's been digging for years still hasn't turned up squat not really surprised what does that mean because he knows something we don't you know I happen to do a little digging of my own and uh, I bet your Rafe doesn't have this it's really amazing what you can find on the internet these days it's just the Saint Dismas cross Oh, is it? Because the one we found was broken and hollow, remember? Holy crap. 
crap, it's still intact. Avery made more than one cross. So whatever's missing from the one in Panama is probably still inside this one. Mm -hmm. well, all right. Well, where is this? Oh, this exquisite piece is going up for auction in three days at the Rossi Estate. The Rossi Estate? Well, you know it. Uh, yeah. No shit. And how do you plan on securing an invite to an exclusive, heavily guarded black market auction? Well, you don't necessarily need an invitation, per uh, se. If you're just going to steal yeah. it. Where are you going to get the money to outbid all the high rollers? Uh, we're not outbidding. Take a second mortgage out on my house, and it still wouldn't be enough to... Yeah, you're going to try and steal it, huh? No. We are. Oh ah! Love it. Love it. Oh, no. No, dude, he, he's a straight man at this point. Man, like, listen, I'm, he's on the straight and narrow. I'm, I'm out. What? No, I, I, I just don't do that kind of thing anymore. Besides, there, there are plenty of other guys that are much more equipped to handle this kind of thing. Like who? Um, I don't know. Like, uh, anybody? Charlie Cutter. No. No, he's my no, go-to no, guy no, for this sort of thing. Fucking Cutter. I don't trust Charlie or anybody else that you've got in that phone with my life, okay? I need you on this one. That's incredibly unfair to ask. Sam, there's got to be another way. Not with the time I got left. Certainly not with Alcazar. Why are you still wearing denim, dude? Fucking disgusting. Stop with smoking. It'll kill you. Hey, hon, it's me. Yeah, uh, listen, you're not gonna believe this. Jameson just walked in here with the permits. Yeah. I know, I know, but, uh, it's like I'm gonna take that Malaysia job after all. Oh, that's super kind of shitty, actually. It's a really good place to stop, actually. So we're going to go ahead and call this episode quits, guys. Again, this is Dominic with Silver Screen Interviews, and thank you for watching this really cinematic episode of Uncharted 4 Thieves End. If you guys enjoyed it, leave a like down below. Let's me know you appreciate the content, you want more of it, all the good jazz. Any comments, criticism, suggestions, critiques, leave down in the comment section below. I love hearing from you guys. Otherwise, have a good night, and we'll see you in the next part.